which face wash are you currently using do mention it in the comment section along with the pros and cons of the face wash so that all of us can relate to it and get talking about it in today's video i'll be sharing an amazing do it yourself face wash that you can prepare right at the comfort of your home using simple ingredients from your kitchen and you are going to be really happy about it i can assure you that do watch the entire video for complete knowledge and great execution let's talk Hello everybody and a very warm welcome to the channel. I hope you all are doing wonderfully great. If you're visiting the channel for the first time, my name is Prerna and this channel's name is Preeti Prerna English where I share amazing do it yourself content related to your hair care, skin care and health care. Using the remedies that I share, my family over here is extremely happy. So do not wait, subscribe the channel and hit the bell icon. In today's video, I'll be sharing with you an amazing do-it-yourself face wash. Yes, you heard me right. You can prepare it at home using very simple ingredients. The only thing is, you have to be open-minded and understand the concept that what face wash actually does. Yes, most of the time, face wash means something fragrant and juicy and very slimy or something that produces a lot of lather, and that's when we feel that it is a face wash. What if I give you some powder and use it on your face and wash it off? you would be like this is not face wash so this is what you need to understand and here is the point that i need to put forward is that you really have to understand that the purpose of your face wash is cleaning your face of the dirt pollutants dead skin any foreign body that's accumulated on the skin and this can be done not only using those fragrant lather forming uh, solutions you can use very simple things right in your kitchen and they are going to give you better results believe me with no side effects at all please just don't worry it's a tried and tested formula you just have to be gentle that's it i am going to tell you how the application has to be but believe me this is one of its kind give it a try and then decide for yourself whether or not it is suitable for you for the preparation of this amazing face wash the first ingredient that you require would be 1 tablespoon of gram flour we call it besan in hindi this is one of its kind and believe me you can use this alone as the face wash yes it's that potent it is very very nutritive for your health so you should consume it as well in various dishes that you prepare but topically it can get rid of every possible pollutant that lands on your skin believe me if you are not very comfortable about making the entire blend you can use this powder alone yes try it out don't believe me i always tell you don't believe me try it out for yourself see the results and then say all right whether or not it suited you i am pretty sure you're going to fall in love with it post this the second ingredient that you require is oatmeal powder we all are very much aware how powerful oatmeals are to clean your gut it is literally something that washes off your entire gut giving you very clear and vibrant skin topical application of oats actually sticks to your skin and you know it brings out the dirt the oil the excess oil that your skin produces absolutely out and what you are left with is very soft and supple skin believe me every individual ingredient that is going to be used in this particular face wash i am going to say it is the most potent of all because they are individually they are very powerful and when they come together it's even powerful So the third powerful ingredient that we are going to use over here to prepare this amazing DIY face wash would be one tablespoon of rice flour. If you do not have rice flour with you right now, what you can do is you can grind uh, rice properly post washing and drying them obviously, and you can just strain the powder. You need very very minute powder. You don't need any granules sticking to the powders or the you know strained portion because it might scratch your skin and you don't want that. So the best is you get flour for yourself. If you, if you do not have, then you can use this grinding uh, thing. But please make sure you strain really very fine powder. Now, one tablespoon of rice flour is going to clean your skin. Number one, obviously, it is going to act as a scrub for your skin. Scrubbing is very gentle scrubbing. It's not something that that that's going to be very harsh. I'm going to tell you how the application is going to be. So another thing that that it actually does is. it works on your complexion i'm not saying that you're going to be fair you know i'm not going to use that word for sure but it is definitely going to work on your skin tone whatever it is if there is some unevenness on your skin tone this is going to fix it and 
you would see the results in the first application itself it is that powerful yes the fourth ingredient that we are using here would be coffee powder which is an amazing and impeccable ingredient to actually remove the tan remove any discoloration in your skin any sort of issue related to color on the skin can be fixed using coffee another thing is coffee is a very good exfoliator so without actually you know scrubbing your face that harshly it can very easily remove the dead skin and the other pollutants on the skin and can give you a very neat and flawless skin the last and the final ingredient that we are using over here would be half tablespoon of sandalwood powder now this is something i am very fond of sandalwood powder is something that actually gives the soothing experience overall in the face wash but the fragrance takes you on another level altogether you can also increase the quantity of sandalwood to like 1 tablespoon again but i am i am using just half of it over here because i already have another face wash that i will share with all of you so mix all the things together and put it in a container preferably glass container but i was not having so i'm putting it in the plastic container for the time being now for the application the first and foremost thing that you really need to understand is these are dried powders and they are supposed to be like that only you cannot touch them with wet hands you cannot put wet spoon into it or anything of that sort they have to be dried only now you have taken the powder in your hands step number 1 or maybe i'm telling you two ways you can use it the first way would be just you know uh, wet your face a little bit you have powder in your hands just take it and start scraping your face a little bit with no pressure at all everything is going to be done by this powder so you are not applying any you know any kind of pressure just gently massage your skin of any kind of you know deposition or whatever it is it will come out second way would be you wet the powder itself in your hands just take two three drops of water make it into a paste and then gently wash it off just like you do it, do it with your face wash simple immediately after using it for the first time you are going to witness the amazing beautiful magic of this diy face wash for yourself and you are going to be surprised baffled happy rejoicing and certainly blissful because you will get something very very beautiful very gentle very easy very cheap and also with no side effects at all i mean these are so many things all together so you must give it a try and let us also know that how did you like it what was your experience making it using it and how are you uh, actually enjoying this entire face wash so my wonderful people i really hope you enjoyed the presentation if you did do let me know in the comment section also do not forget to like the video it's very important for the algorithm to understand that you are liking the creator and the content if somebody in your circle requires this video do share it with all of them if you are new to the channel do not go without subscribing because i bring so many beautiful content over here using which my family is extremely happy and you would also be i'll see you all in the next one with something magical for your hair skin and health till then take really good care and stay connected to all the channels of preeti prerna yes there are more take care